So this is going to be interesting. Um, this is going to be the first time that I've uh, ever done a like local recording of a race. Uh, unfortunately, I'm having to do this because I'm still having some uh, ISP issues. Uh, the dreaded network maintenance makes it to where I can stream for maybe 10 or 20 minutes and then my bit, my bit rate just completely drops. So Instead of doing this live on Twitch, um, I'll just be doing this in a local recording and then uploading it to YouTube um, if anybody is interested in watching it. I'll still be providing some live commentary on what I'm doing with the race, just in case... Uh, you, you won't be able to, like, ask any questions live or anything like that, but hopefully it helps offer some insight as to what I'm doing and uh, what I'm thinking throughout the race. Oh boy, that's loud. Alright, so week 25, rules are pretty much the same. Uh, nothing has really changed. Alright. Let's go ahead and put this in performance mode. That way I am not... Uh, lagging or anything like that. Uh, looks like we have a minuet start too, which is pretty nice. Minuet start and we also have uh, we also have a medallion start too, so potentially we only have to do five dungeons. Uh, I do not see any swords, so it looks like we're going to be starting as a child. Let me go ahead and get my uh, notes ready to go. And we'll go ahead and get this started. Three, two, one. Good luck. Alright, Goran City. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Alright, so typically, I think I would uh, immediately use Minuet, but I kind of want to go down to Kakarika real quick. Actually, you know what? Let's do this real quick. Uh, actually, no, no. We'll, we'll, we'll stick with Kakariko. Um, if I need to, I can always come back with the save warp. And uh, get myself uh, a fire source to set up the pot. But uh, I'm not going to worry about that just yet. Because I feel like if I do the pot too early, uh, I'm going to forget about throwing a bomb in it. And that would be no bueno. Alright, we got ourselves a heart piece. Let me go ahead and switch my uh, items up here real quick. I mean, I've been playing um, some other randos recently, so my... Uh, my execution might be a little bit lacking, uh, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. Shouldn't be too bad. Alright, but yeah, kind of wanted to get down here and at least get chickens, and then also check the uh, skull hint real quick, just to get out of the way. Since we do have warp songs, we can get to and from wherever we need to go pretty fast. Alright, so 10 is bombs. 13 is a bloopy. Alright, so we don't need any skulls whatsoever. That's good. Alright, let's head over here. Alright, so we got chickens out of the way. 10, 20, and 30 are dead. Not too bad so far. Nocturne. All right, cool. I don't feel foolish choice. I like to see that. All right, so we got Hyrule filled as a foolish choice. We got Nocturne on Saria Song. Very good start, uh, song wise so far. Like to get warp songs early. Bamazora's Fountain is a piece of heart, so the Ice Dive is dead. Let's go ahead and mark that down. Ice Dive. Uh, well, thanks. <laughs> Already got it, but thanks. Alright. All 
right, let's uh, let's go ahead and uh, get everything here in Lost Woods real quick. Death Mountain Trail, Path of Bongo. Alright. Death Mountain Trail, Path of Bongo. Kind of curious what we'll find there. But we know Shadow Temple is something we have to do. Oh, just barely landed on the stump, too. Yeah, I think the last, uh, last OTR scene I played was, um, not the Bunny Hood Race, but the last monthly scene. <laughs> nice. Great start. Nice thing about Nocturne is I can quickly get uh, Dampy out of the way too. Not have to worry too much about not having a Sun Song for that. I almost forgot what that last note was. That is unfortunate. It's very unfortunate. I'm honestly not even going to keep track of skulls. Kind of pointless too. All right, what we got here? All right, so boomerang chest, dead. All right. Uh, you know what? We're gonna open these. Boomerang chest. All right, I was hoping for uh, some bomb cheese, but we didn't, we didn't get what we wanted. Let's go uh, check the shop real quick, see what we get, and then we'll go do uh, carry sword check, and then we'll uh, we'll warp out of here. All right, we got Riz letter for two hundred. Uh, let's see, is there anything here that is worthwhile? I could I could get that showed right now. I can get a discount too, so. We might as well. Give us something for adult. Alright, we haven't seen uh, a hint for Baronade yet, so... No idea if we're actually going to need it, but you never know. Oh, I was gonna side hop up there. No luck. Alright. We get this check out of the way, and then, uh. We'll go mark it. Nothing here. See where our stone dungeons are real quick. Before we go anywhere. Alright, Jobby's a stone, Fire's a stone, and Deku's a stone. Alright. Jobby, Fire, Deku. That's two un that's two unpleasant dungeons out of the way. And we'll just have to deal with the loss of Deku. That shouldn't be a problem. Grill Valley, foolish choice. All right. Uh, King Zora is dead. Uh, Flare Dancer atop of Fire Temple. Uh, Fire Temple Hammer Check is dead. And we already got that hint. Nice. Windfall music for Marknet. It's almost fitting.
Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and get this in out of the way. Just to get some more information. Skull in the gate behind the water temple is a small key. Alright. Skull in the gate. We'll go ahead and get this check out of the way. Since we can actually get that right now. Let's see if I botch this. Well, at least that bit I didn't botch. Cool. Actually worked out well. Now we got money for our shops. Alright. Speaking of which... Oh, there we go, baby. Getting some bomb chains. Uh, let's see, we got a lens for 215. Lens, market, potion, 2.15. So, we got some double wallet locked items. We also got 10 bomb tunes, which is nice. Eh, that, that really worth it. I think what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to run over to Lon Lon. Let's just go ahead and get that out of the way. And since Gerudo Valley is foolish, uh, we don't I don't feel like I have to make the trip uh, over to Valley Lake just yet. So I could just easily warp there via serenades. I think what I'm going to do is I'll actually set that up to where I probably warp to Lake Hylia after checking Lalon. And then once it once it turns nighttime, we're going to go check Dampy. Because we can just quickly get back to Lake Hylia. I actually feel like this is a strong uh, list of foolish locations so far, both Hyrule Field and Gerudo Valley. Because they take uh, time costly uh, overworld checks out of the equation, and I can get to my dungeons quicker. Don't have to get that skull. Just run over here and get this, um, get this song check real quick. Doesn't look like I'm dropping any frames uh, on the local recording, so that's nice. Alright, nice. That's a song check we can do too whenever we go and uh, check Dampy. Or we could wait and do it as an adult too, since we'll have a sword instead of uh, messing with sticks. Either or. It's actually about to turn night right now, and we probably won't have enough time to do fishing before Dampy leaves, so we can always come back and uh, get that little baby a serenade. That shouldn't be a problem at all. Alright. Actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll, we'll go ahead and do... Um, uh, royal family tomb is child because we can do um, some nice little shenanigans with that. Four simple on the path of Morpha. All right. Bora 
honest. Of, uh... Just gonna have to get broken stick real quick. Yeah, we got enough space here. Yeah, so far pretty strong uh, song starts. Song of Time, not too bad. Alright. You know what? I'll take it. <laughs> I will take it. Just, just to, just to get my health back. All right, let's, uh, let's get Dampy out of the way real quick. Sure, why not? Alright, just so I don't forget it, I am going to go back and get, um, get fishing out of the way. Because I should have enough time to do that, uh, before it turns daytime. And then, uh, once we get out of fishing, we'll go back to, uh... We'll go back to market. Sorry, brain fart while I'm playing this. And that way, once we go adult and we hit up uh, Kakariko, it should be uh, becoming daytime again. I could have probably got that lure in a little bit closer to me. That's all right. At least I didn't have to cast it twice. Oh boy, am I glad I came back for that. <laughs> am I glad I came back for that. Whew. Child fishing was gonna do me in again. All right, let's see here. Let's um, yeah, let's go ahead and get Night Market out of the way. Shouldn't take terribly long at all. Might need to grab a uh, a wallet at some point. Just in case, so. Uh, well, Jobby's a stone, so we might not need that letter as badly as I once thought. But Tim Bomb Chews, um, DC is a possibility. Oh no, ooh. Ooh, that's all sorts of nasty. Actually, you know what? Hold on. There is something I want to do real quick. Before I go adult, um, this will this won't really add any extra time as far as time of day. But I can quickly get the pot set up. If I can get the stick lit up. Yeah, 
we'll get the pot set up. That way, once we do get bombs, we can just come back here and get this done. And then... We'll go ahead and run in here. Check and see what this shop is. Alright. So far, our shops really haven't been anything. That's okay, though. All right, let's go adults. See what we got. So for starters, um, we got Minuet Nocturne, which already give us uh, give us Song Check and Fast Access to Kakariko, so we don't have to dawdle around for too long. Let's check uh, what our specific medallions are. Alright, so we got Shadowed Temple as light, Forest as vanilla, Water, DC, okay. Alright, then Spirit is the last light arrow cutscene medallion. Sun Song, all right. Well, that gets us one more check in the graveyard that we can do right now. Thank you, Poe. Just no big chest so far. Alright, maybe maybe Dampy will uh, change things up. Who knows? Alright, so far the flames are being nice to me. Uh, we're just gonna go around. I'll take a 48. Wasn't too bad. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll grab it too. Winner! And before I leave, let's grab that money there real quick. Just in case the shop actually has something nice. Nice thing about having Sunsong, I can immediately do this. Oh no, the gunshot. Alright, and there's the rest of the money I would have needed. Don't need it. All right, opponent song. Do a little bit of parkour here. 
Gotta remember man on roof too before I leave. Alright. Hyrule Field, full of choice. Yeah, we got plenty of money. Honestly, I'm thinking about just doing DC right now. Oh boy, hookshot. A cheap hookshot. There we go. Perfect. Nah, not really worth it. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> yeah, we'll just have to conserve our bomb cheese until we get a bomb bag. But I am perfectly fine using uh, some bomb cheese for Dodongo's Cavern. Shouldn't take too many. And we got our money back. Perfect. So, Death Mountain Trail Path of Bongo. Interesting. Oh, well, I wanted hearts. There we go. Alright, so we're gonna be doing some safe scum in here with our bomb shoes. It'll make DC a little bit longer. But I'm fine with that. So, first things first, let's go ahead and get these out of the way. Red Ruby. Oh yeah, that's a bloopy. Alright, so we can get those bomb cheese back. Because at the end of the day, what we're looking for is information. Well, and important items, but information works just as well. No, oh, I moved a bit there. Let's just do it this way. <laughs> they kind of sound like mines. All right, so we're gonna do another little, another little bit of um, bomb juice scumming. Let's see what's back here. Not worth it. So we'll get that bomb sheet back. <clears throat> yeah, we'll make DC a little bit longer, but that's that's no problem at all. If I if I get to save a few bomb chews <clears throat> after the fact, I'm okay with it. Uh, 
And this is going to be the bit here where I'm not going to be able to save scum this all that well because I really don't want to go through this cutscene again. It's a tunic of sorts. Although, we're pretty close to five hearts. I don't think it's that important. Oh, no. No swag. Did it too early, and then not enough. Oh, hey, it's here. No, I'm just doing a recording. Alright, what do we got over here? Looks like a normal chest. Somehow that worked? Okay. Check uh, skull back here real quick. Wait, why did I grab it? <laughs> why didn't I grab it? Alright, so we're gonna try uh, bomb juice strats. Been a hot minute since I've done them. Actually, we got a big chest here. What do we got? Oh, it would be a Kikiri sword. Well, if we want to, that does give us give us access to Deku. DC done in about 30 minutes. With Minuet, I feel like a dip in the forest isn't necessarily a bad idea. Ooh, even better. Get those hover boots, too. The Dongo always delivers chat. I don't know why I said chat. This is a local recording. <laughs> no one's watching this live. Alright. Um. See, now the problem is, is I only have one bomb chain. But I also really want to get um, the song. Thank you. 
Yeah, I really want to get the song, so that's what we're going to go for. So you know what, one bomb chain? I'm going to put you to real good use. We've already checked that Gordon shop, and it didn't have anything, so... Oh, I don't need that ruby. Alright, so fire is a stone dungeon. Requiem, perfect. Requiem on Bolero. So that means we're gonna have most of our uh, most of our songs really early in this scene. And hopefully Requiem gets its storms. That'd be nice. Alright, no explosives, so just to play this safe, I'm actually going to go up here. Actually, I, I probably didn't even have to do that, honestly. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Because I can check this hint while I'm at it. Accidentally woke up a uh, big run. That was not meant to be the case. Fortress. Okay. I don't know why I spelled that out. I usually put GF for that, but been playing too many other randomizers. Yeah, we'll grab it. Why not? All right. So ideally, I'd like to see storms. Cause that gives us another Death Mountain Trail check, just right off the bat. Alright. Whoa! Oh, Leavers, why? What song are we getting from this? Sorry, a song. Alright, you know what? That's cool. Um, let's see here. Alright, so we got that. I'm perfectly fine with going into Forest Temple this early. Let's, uh, let's check it out. See what happens. We do have a uh, skull shuffle for dungeons, so that's just immediately more checks early on for forest sample. All right, got ourselves a key and immediately big chest. Good call to come here early. Very good call to come here early. We got a long shot. Alright. We do have solid time, so we could do uh, courtyard stuff.
Only problem is we won't we won't be able to do much else in a dungeon because we don't have strength or boom. But still a decent amount of checks in the courtyard that can get out of the way. Alright, another big chest. What we got? Alright, a bow. <laughs> that makes things a little bit easier. French vanilla bow. It, it, actually in the same room, too. Just a lower chest. Go through the door. Now, if we found strength in here, I'd be super happy. We'd just do it right off the bat. Two keys. What do we got here? Wide arrows. I'll go ahead and grab that early. Why not? And... Big chest? Nope, but a key chest. Go ahead and grab it. Uh, there is... One more chest that we can get in here. That is the uh, floor master check. But yeah, already having long shot for water temple, very nice. Um, let's see. That Rio's letter. We can get that now. Which would put ice into logic. Now we're gonna have all but one key. Forest, that's nice. All right. Well, uh, let's see. Let's. Uh, we could probably do chop. No, no, we can't do much of child spirit, unfortunately. Hmm. Not without like some sort of uh, projectile. I can go down and do a shooting gallery in Kakariko real quick. Um. Part of me is kind of wanting to turn in the letter. No, I don't. I don't have a logical way to turn in the letter now that I think about it. No skill, no explosives. Yeah, just no way of actually doing it. Um, so what we'll do instead? Um, I'll run up Zora River as an adult, just to get some more hints and also get some free standing items. That's never a bad idea. Especially this early one. <clears throat> Another play could potentially be going to GTG. 
could have something there. Alright, five hearts. Not, not feeling uh, too bad about that. Yeah, it might not it might not be a bad idea to get that Rio's letter in a carrying shop. Might not be a bad idea. I kind of mull over it a bit while we're uh, getting getting some checks out of the way here in Zora's River. Because it is a bit of a time commitment to actually go through with that. Thank you, Shields. We got gunshot boots. Uh, Deku is also an option open to us. It is still technically out of logic, but is an option. A quick option at that. Valley full of choice. Uh, I want to say we get five foolish scents or five foolish locations with these scent. Um, yeah, with these scents, and then five path locations. Just haven't been getting lucky so far, and we definitely don't need that. All right, Gorn City on the path to King Dodongo. All right. I think it's time we go back, child. See what we can do. Gorn City's on the path to King Dodongo. So what that means is, um, quite possibly bomb back. So I'm gonna try something real quick. See if we just get lucky. We have Saria's song. So I'm gonna go ahead and play it to Darunia. See what happens. Get Bomb Bag, that'd be nice. Oh. A scale? Okay. Actually, you know what? I'm perfectly fine with that. Because that, uh, that just gave me some other options. Go ahead and while I'm at it, let me go ahead and oh, before before I forget, let's go ahead and play Saria's song here. Get Skull Kid out of the way. Sorry about that. That's unfortunate. But yeah, we're gonna get some, uh... Let me grab some money real quick here. Alright, a little bit more money. 
Let's get that letter. You know what? While we're here, let's just go ahead and get uh, that good tree out of the way. It will not take us uh, long at all to do. We haven't seen any hints so far suggesting that we not do it. I was going to try to um, side hop up there. Yeah, yeah, Navi. Yeah, yeah. I hear you. Alright. Shouldn't take too long at all to get. See what doing uh, Deku Tree Owl Laundry gets us. Worst comes to worst, if we don't find anything special in here, it's only like a two or three minute time sink. Okay, maybe a little bit more than three minutes, but not too much. Whenever I'm, <laughs> even whenever I'm not live, the curse of that spider still gets me. All right, let's see here. So far, no dice on these. There is going to be the one skull back here that I just simply cannot do. Don't have it explosive yet, so. Huh. Okay. Try that again. I keep missing that. Odd. Alright, maybe I'm a little too far away. Or maybe I was a little bit too close. Alright. Either way, we ended up getting it. Yeah, something's telling me that, uh... Deck is a bit on the barren side. Just a bit on the barren sun. Alright, let's see if we can uh, get this going. The answer is no. How about round two? Uh, it's a little too much to the left, I think. That looks good. There we go. Oh, and then I completely missed the wall. <laughs> no smooth moves for me.
Yeah, not a whole lot of extra time. And this is fairly easy to, to get done. Cherry Coke Zero burns going down. I'm just not used to it. Wow! <laughs> Interesting. Slingshot on Gomo. Who would have thought? That's definitely out of logic. <laughs> but I guess we'll use it. Speaking of which, let's uh, go ahead and equip it. Just to get slingshot uh, out of the way. Nice. That stone of agony is just gonna keep sitting there. So let's see, we need strength for forest. We need iron boots for water. Um, we're gonna need two levels of strength and mirror shield for spirit. Uh, shadow, we need to find dens. And then we're also gonna need explosives along the way too. Let's um, do ourselves a favor real quick and check and see what the shop is. Yeah, we're definitely going to need that. Alright. So instead of farming for the money here, because it's going to be quite time consuming, I have a better idea. Because we have skill, we can get back here fairly quickly. Dono's Cavern, Path to Twin Robo. Okay. Oh shit, that's right. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so DC was Path to Twin Robo. Let's see, we found hovers. What else did we find there? Uh, at the bow. Oh, uh, Kikiri sword. Kikiri swords. Which the only thing that was in Kiki uh, in Deku was the slingshot. So, well, you know what? That might actually work out because, well, actually no. Because the seed is expecting me to find my slingshot elsewhere. If it's expecting that. It's definitely expecting hover boots, that's for sure. But now that I have my slingshot, child um, spirit doesn't seem too far-fetched. Let's just go ahead and get a little bit of extra money. So I think, yeah, what we'll do is we'll, um, we'll get that mirror shields. We'll get everything else that we need in Zora's domain, since now we know it's not barren. Let's see, we're about an hour in. 
Not too, not too bad progress for an hour in. I feel like we're maybe one or two items away from just, just straight up doing a dungeon blitz mode. Not too bad at all. And it feels like the scene is definitely wanting us to go in the Shadow Temple for something. Besides just clearing it out. Fish. Alright, go ahead and give me that. We got our mirror shield. Now, why did I get a fish? I'm not necessarily going in a job here. I, I'm crazy. <laughs> just, my mind is just going everywhere. See what we get out of this, and then we'll uh, we'll rush child spirit. See what we get. All right, that's a skull chest. We don't need that. I feel pretty equipped for child spirit, at least the first bit. We don't have explosives, so we won't get very far into it. But yeah, we'll do this, and then if this is still fruitless, uh, we will rush uh, Ice Cavern. See if we can get Song of Storms, because I feel like that's our next big jump. Either Bottom of the Well or GTG. So far, uh, the option for Child Spirit looking pretty good, judging off that big chest. Might grab that. Seeing as I'm not quite at Sit's Heart yet, I don't have a tunic. There we go. Yeah, I'm pretty, uh, pretty comfortable not getting a tunic at all. No key, though. So we're completely locked out. Ooh. Ooh. Double magic. Definitely didn't need it. Definitely didn't need it. All right. Still can't do uh, anything else in Forest. We're locked out from that strength. 
Um, I mean, Fire Temple's an option. Jabu's an op- yeah, really the only dungeon options we have at the moment are stones or mini dungeons. Um, let's see. Oh. What am I doing? <laughs> it's gonna be faster to get to, uh, Ice Cavern this way. This cavern comes down to one of two choices. It's either Storms or Bolero. That kind of dictates where we're gonna go. If we get Storms there, we'll end up going uh, bottom of the well. If we get Bolero, we'll end up going... Um, Uh, we'll end up going fire, probably. I'm usually not so keen to dip fire whenever it's a stone dungeon, but it could be useful. Give that another shot. That's better. Ice dive is dense. Um, I am gonna go ahead and get the uh, gossip stones real quick, just to get a little bit more information. Still have a, I feel like a couple of foolish locations out there to figure out. But then we get stuff like that. Hello, there's our strength. Alright, so that's four simple we can do now. We're gonna go ahead and get ice done since we're out here. It's just a pain in the ass to come back out here. King Zora is dead, so we do not have to worry about thawing him out. We'd be doing some glitchless jumps in here, too. We might as well just go ahead and get the fish out. <laughs> nice. I botched it. Oh, nice. Oh, hello. I will gladly take more bomb cheese. <laughs> I like that. Hell, I don't know. Uh, the bomb cheese and ice might have, might have been worth it themselves. Alright. 
Ice has a big item in here. Ooh. Not quite the big item I want to see. The nice thing about Ice Cat in these settings is there's at least slightly more checks. We got a claim check there too, so let's go ahead and get that. That is a Death Mountain trail check. over here. Just a normal chest. Alright. Too far away, I think. Ah! <laughs> I keep getting a stutter grab. That's not what I want. There we go. That took entirely too long. I know, cursed guy. It took entirely too long. See if this other one is just as rough. Almost. I right, when I get on second try. You know what? Uh, I'll I'll take it. Considering how <laughs> how little uh, Zuder I've been playing recently, I'll take it. What's the verdict? Do I get Storms or do I get Bolero? Bolero. Alright. Oh, that's too far. Which means our Song of Storms is on, um, Beating Forest Temple. It's on Prelude. Which is perfectly fine, because we can go beat Forest right now. That's exactly what I'm about to do, as soon as I turn in, uh, Claim Shack. Oh, 
Let's see if uh, a claim check is what I needed. It was not. Alright, so claim check has been turned in. We still don't have anything from Death Mountain Trail. Uh, it's locked behind. Oh, shit. You know what? I just realized I have bomb genes. <laughs> I could have very easily gotten that fairy fountain while I was there. Let me go back and do that real quick. Ooh, only five bomb genes, though. Ugh. Not great. <clears throat> Let's see if this is it. And then we'll know for sure if this if this is it or if it's Storm's Grotto. Yep, Storm's Grotto. So let's go finish up Forest Simple. Hopefully we find something else in Forest Simple. That'd be cool. That'd be very cool. <clears throat> oh, I never marked that I had my strength. There we go. Let's get that out too. Alright, so what do we need to beat the rest of this game? Oh! I got lights too, duh. I haven't been really doing a good job with my tracker. Uh, so we can beat Forest. Uh, we need... Theoretically, either another skill or Iron Boots to beat Water Temple. Um, specifically Iron Boots if the boss key is in the central pillar. And, uh, Dens for Shadow. Strength Tune for Spirit. So, yeah. Not too bad. Not, not too bad for an hour and 17. And the only hit that we didn't get was one for Phantom Ganon. Oh, hello. Just find another wallet in here while we're at it. Although at this point, I'm pretty sure we've checked every... Yeah, every, um, every shop. We could get lens now. I thought I'd get the uh, shish kebab switch, but no, nah, no dice. too high. But yeah, Irons, Irons, Strength 2, and Dems. What we're looking at right now. And we got some pretty checked in locations left, so that's, that's not bad at all. Got 
Got a couple of checks left here in Four Simple, too. Alright, there's all of our small keys. I don't think we've seen our boss key yet. As an alright stealth, I was fine. Excuse me. Yeah. I'm starting to think that that, uh. The Donald's Cavern Path to Twin Robo is definitely the hover boots. So if I had to take a guess, Strength 2 is probably in Shadow. Chest. No, heart chest. Uh, I'll take the heart refill. Why not? Why not? That's twice I've messed that up. Pretty sloppy. I guess I don't need the, those arrows that bad. So far, nothing else in uh, Forest. And one of these two checks has to be the boss game. Down the basement. So we're not really in a position yet to tackle any of our other medallion dungeons. And I lost the bow. Or the arrows. Yeah. 
Why did I shoot him with the puck shot? Bow would have been faster. Alright. Alright, this way. <laughs> I've gotten discombobulated with uh, the four space mode. And then it's this way. Cave music, huh? Cave music from A Link to the Past. I guess it's kind of fitting. So far, my boss fights have been pretty clean. Let's see if uh, this one stays part for the course. Sloppy. They didn't get that um, that second crouch down whenever he went down the first time, so I had to improvise with how many times I was going to stun him. Well. What that will do is give us Song of Storms, and that opens some options for us. Um, I feel like we take advantage of that option and immediately go back to Death Mountain Trail. Once we get this. No, that's the wrong song. <laughs> Prelude is different. There we go. Alright, we have all of our songs. Uh, we can get whatever Death Mountain Trail Path to Bongo. Hopefully it spins and we just go straight in. Because that would be cool. It's realistically the only thing we need left for... Um, for Shadow. Ah, uh, hello. <laughs> I just could not get up there. See, targeting was just not working for me. Alright. Excuse me. Yeah, there's our big chest. gonna go ahead and uh, go back to Shadow Temple. Now yeah, we can do that. Still no bomb bag, but that's no problem.
we should find something in here. Seeing as Dean's seen path to Twin Rova was uh, Hover Boots. Very likely it's something inside of Shadow Temple. this point. Sits hearts is plenty. See, we should be done with Shadow Temple a little bit after the 140 mark. So not doing too bad with that, if I don't make too many mistakes. have much left in the way of uh, Deku Nuts. See what's over here. I got got. Got got by the spooter. Damn. I'm just running low on all sorts of consumables. Especially whenever I keep messing like that. Alright. You know what? Ah! <laughs> Alright, you know what? <laughs> oh, that was terrible. It was absolutely terrible. Alright, don't 
need that. Do need that. Don't need that. Let's see this. I haven't used uh, Pharaoh's Wind yet. Speed things up. Get some efficiency in here. I was sitting here thinking, oh wait, I don't have bombs for the pot room. Then realized I have strength. Medinkas Donkas chat. boots and I'll take the arrow refill perfect all right so we can do water right after this what all right that'll work Ooh. better make this one count And then that happens. Oh, that was that was very close. Man, I feel just a tad bit rusty. nuts. I'm actually gonna have to just hold a bomb chain. Yeah, it was nothing. Alright, alright, alright. for a drink break. So yeah, what we got at this point is basically mirror show, or no, not mirror show, strength two for go mode. In the Dongo's cavern was path to twin robo. We found hovers. Hover has got us iron boots. Because we haven't really found anything else in here yet. Besides said iron boots. Ice Dive is dead. So, let's see. Irons. So it's possible that Strength Tune could be in Water Temple. 
because there's not much else that Iron Boots could be needed for. Uh, Ice Dive was hinted as dead. Toilet is automatically dead in these settings. So, nothing for those. This boy just did not want to die. Alright. No, nuts either, so, uh. I have to improvise a bit. I don't know, at this point, this may be another bomb bagless seed. Alright, there's a big chest. We may potentially be in go mode. <laughs> we need to keep our bomb chews about us, but we may potentially be in go mode. Oh, let's not forget the skull. Oh, I actually need that. <laughs> like, what am I doing? That should be boss game. Yeah. Boss key in the very back. Very sparing with these two bomb chains that we got. Because we're going to need at least one of them for the top of Spirit. Actually, we're going to need two of them for Spirit. Well, maybe. Maybe. That's not what I wanted to see. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> I had bow to so tight. I am actually going to die. Alright, playing safe strats. I, I messed up that bongo fight really bad. That was dismal. But yeah, I think depending on where... Um, I think water... Okay, so water temple gate skull was a key. You know what? I'll actually grab it. Why not? Just to get the heart refill. Um, I think we knock out Spirit first. Just to see where we stand with our bomb count. Because water will not take very long. I 
I don't remember Requiem for a second. healthy scene. Eight hearts, double magic. But yeah, whether or not we're in go mode depends on how many of these bomb shoes I might have to let loose. Because I think bare minimum we're going to need at least one for spirit. We might not need any at all for water, depending on where, what chests are located where. If at any point we find a bomb bag, we're just in go mode. String three, huh? Okay. I haven't seen a hint saying that outside game this castle's full, so who knows? We do need that. That's our first spirit key. So this is entirely dependent upon how early we find boss key for spirit temple. If we can find it before we need to use bombs on Beamos, I think we're set. That's a red ruby. That's not good. Another big chest. Ow. And then I bonked into the chest. Nice. Nicely done. Neighbor. <laughs> Neighbors? We're at paperweight percent. better. I know you can do it. We don't quite need that. Alright, I am possibly going to have to save scum out of this room coming up. So I think what I'm going to do first is... Mm, yeah. Let's do it this way. Because I really don't want to use any keys. We got a skull back here that we can check. Another key I'll take. So 
So that should be enough small keys to get the twin rover. Ow. gonna save right here there's our boss key sure why not Don't think I'm really going to need it, but I'll take it. Alright, so bare minimum, we're going to be able to get uh, get away with only using one bomb tube for spirit. Which leaves us the option to save scum bomb choose for uh, for water, and honestly, might not even have to come down to that. Don't need to deal with that. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run with the odds right now. Ow! The odds that that one bomb chain will carry me. Oh, don't hit me. I will gladly take damage from the bomb chain. Ow. Alright, so far not bad for Spirit Temple. Okay. 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 <laughs> that hurt. Probably gonna have to deal with crit wiggle. That's not gonna be fun. No, that wasn't aimed at me. A great start. Damn, they're staying right on top of me.
Really? Really? That was a pretty shitty Twin Rovo, first phase, but that's okay. I'm not sure if I should say that fighting Twin Rova with just half a heart is a, like, a badass thing or something I shouldn't be bragging about. <laughs> because I did take that massive hit from uh, Nimbu earlier. Time to go to water. Oh, you know what? I don't have a whole lot of health, so take me. I'm gonna need a little bit of health for the drown timer. And then we can go. Alright, moment of truth. We already know where one water temple small key's at. Nice. <clears throat> and we're honestly just looking for, uh, I'll take all that. Yeah, we're honestly just looking for Bosky at this point. Me thinking that there was going to be bombs coming out of them. Alright, we're about to use our last bomb chain. Because both of them lock keys. We gotta do it. Officially without any explosives. May Dodongo help us. <clears throat> Dodongo helped us. <laughs> 
chat, we are now in go mode. And again, we have a bomb bagless scene. Not too, not too bad of a scene. Um, breaking the logic a little bit did help. In so much as it just allowed us to confirm that uh, we could just go straight to uh, adult spirit and kind of narrow down what the uh, Dodongo's Cavern uh, path to Twin Robo would be. I think our greatest divergence was Deku Tree. And Deku Tree is like all of five minutes, so not that big of a divergence. It definitely feels like the bottleneck was um, getting those, wa uh, getting that wallet for Rito's letter. Or just having the mind, the, the, the thought of mind to do weep skip to get that strength. It kind of set everything in motion. Because your bow is French vanilla forest. You get hurt, hook shot super early on if you check your Kakariko shops. And it also, forests also have your long shot too, so. I the seed really want wants you to rush for us. The question will be how many people will have that mindset to rush for us? I never even bothered to look at my adult spawn. Nice. <laughs> and we only collected five skulls this entire scene. Uh, let's go ahead and... Oh, you know what sucks? We don't have, uh, we don't have any nuts. I literally used, uh, all of my consumables this scene. Had no extras left. I think the last time I had nuts drop was uh, the four simple Baba. I, I get the feeling people are going to take that out of context. Ooh. Do we have Bossa Nova? As we go into Ganon's castle? I like it. for this bit either. try something here. Don't know how it's going to work, but we're going to try it. Mm -hmm. 
Didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to. <laughs> and I stayed way too close. Alright, it was a little sloppy. Not quite what I had in mind. I wanted to hit both of them at the same time. It's actually going to be a really fast seed. How do I think about it? 207? At Ganon? Yeah, I feel like the sooner someone goes into Forest Temple, the better off they're going to be time-wise. And I just got lucky that I was able to find bomb shoes as I went along, so I didn't necessarily have to stop what I was doing to go find a bomb bag. That was very nice. Right in the nut. Perfect. I apologize in advance for interrupting the Undertale music, but it had to be done. Maybe we'll get just as just as better music for Ganon. Who knows? Um, I don't have any. Yeah, I don't have any way to save Master Sword damage. No bigger in sword. No hammer. <clears throat> I will I will gladly take that trade off though. If you were to tell me I could get to Ganon at 209, but I didn't have a way to save Master Sword damage, I'd take that every single day of the day. What's a few extra hints? Close. Try to keep around about the same camera angle so I don't have to improvise the movement too much. And then that happens. <laughs> That wasn't part of the plan. Definitely was not part of the plan. Got a little ahead of myself there on the targeting. And on the plus side, since this is going to be a shorter recording, that means it's going to take less time to upload to YouTube. By the way, hi YouTube. I hope you've enjoyed this. I would do the whole uh, like, share, subscribe spiel, but... If you like watching randos, just swing on by. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. You know what? I'll, I'll take that. <laughs> For some reason, uh, hitting the timer stop wasn't stopping it, but I think a few seconds isn't really going to matter too much whenever my finishing time is 2 hours 11 minutes. 
Um, but yeah, that was uh, Bunny Hood Race Week 25. Uh, hopefully you all enjoyed it. Uh, hopefully sometime soon my internet service provider stops uh, constantly going through with uh, upgrade maintenance so I can finally get it back to streaming. But uh, who knows? Maybe, uh, maybe I'll enjoy this format enough to where I do some more of these uh, like local recording uh, fireside chats, I guess if you want to call it that, something like that. Maybe I need a, like a little fireplace gif running in the background. But yeah, hope you all enjoyed it. I will see you all next time.